Pathway USL, even though it's MLS next. Here's the point. My, my friend, Roberto Bill. Roberto Bill is an extremely technical player. Extremely. Played at high level, played Division One soccer or whatever. Um, but he, he played in Europe. He played in, in uh, South America. He played with Dunga, from, from the captain of the Brazilian national team. And I played with him. Like, just as coaches, we play against kids. He, he was 48, 49 at the time, and he was so technical. Um, and I asked him, I'm like, where'd you learn your technique? And he would always talk about it. He grew up in Brazil and uh, Ecuador, I think, because his dad was um, stationed there because he was a um, – he worked for the White House. He was a, uh, what do you call those uh, government officials at station, uh, like at an embassy? At a, an, an ambassador. Uh, an ambassador. He was an ambassador for Brazil. Anyways, he grew up on the streets. That's where he learned how to play. That's where he became technical. You become who you're associated with. That's If you hang out with druggies, you might probably end up doing drugs. If you hang out with very extremely technical players, you're going to be very good. If you decided that you want to skateboard on the streets of the United States and California or wherever, but around a bunch of skateboarders without a coach, you would learn a lot of cool tricks and stuff and you'd be able to do a lot of amazing things like they do on the X Games. Because that's what they do. They put hours in. They, they just love it. It's different. The culture in Brazil is a little different. All their parents watch the games. They shut down the cities. They all play a certain style. They're also in Brazil, they have a style. They, the expectation is you must be technical. You must connect passes. You must look up, and, and it's okay to be creative and try to take players on. That is a heavy discussion uh, or a heavy expectation. What's expect, expectations here? A anyone know? What's, what's expect be big, run over the other person. Uh, win at all costs, kick it far and hope and, 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 and two foot tackle someone if you're lucky. I don't know. We, we have no identity. We have a lot of confusion. So that's a question I have for you. I mean, if, if you were going to be, uh, try to put yourself in a situation that you can compete at the next level, wouldn't you want to grow up on the streets of Brazil? Wouldn't you want the luxury of just stepping out of your house and just right outside they're playing soccer and you can get a pickup game any day of the week? Isn't that the problem we have in America? There's no pickup soccer. It's not a love sport. There's so many other things to love other than that. Um, it, it, it is uh, confusing times. But I, I do have a solution for us. But before we get to if you enjoyed that clip, you can enjoy all the clips at youtube.com forward slash Coach Cameron Soccer to get all my content. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know what's going on and when we appear online which is typically every Sunday, 7 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Hope to see you this Sunday for our next live show.